Hi, I'm Chris Martirano here with American Music and Sound and our great friends at Sweetwater Sound. It's my privilege to show you the Nord Piano 3, the latest generation in the Nord Piano line. The Nord Piano 3 represents a significant step forward in virtual piano realization from a hardware product. This instrument features a really great keyboard action that's been greatly improved. More weight has been added. They have three contacts that allow you to read the velocity and give you much greater velocity resolution. And the instrument plays so evenly and well balanced due to Nord using a great technology to balance the keyboard physical actions to make them play wonderfully. Also in addition, there's a beautiful new OLED display. Right now I have the triple pedal lyre hooked up to the piano. A single cable comes in and gives me three different pedals. The sustained pedal can do half pedal damping. You also have pedal noise that you can regulate the amount of simulating and you're actually hearing the dampers lift up when you step on it hard or if you step on it soft. It's reading the velocity of the pedal and giving you the appropriate damper noise you'd hear from a real piano. You also have some really great new features added here in the instrument. Uh, they added a vibe effect that's very cool. And also in addition now, the library is expanding. The piano library, there's a gentleman who's actually modeled pianos based on a Mozart piano and a piano that Beethoven would have played. And these are available in the piano library. You can read more about that on Nord's site. I'm going to show you more of the sounds. This is the Lady D piano. I'm going to go to the Silver Grand piano and we'll check that out. This is a different grand piano sound. There are many, many different pianos. The memory has been expanded. You get one gigabyte of piano memory using, of course, Nord's proprietary lossless formula, so you can actually pack a lot of sound in there. Uh, their libraries are free to the user, which is a great thing. You can go to the Nord site and download the appropriate pianos you want. They can be uh, electronic pianos, tine pianos, reed pianos, acoustic pianos, upright pianos, harpsichords, clavinets. They have an exploding library for the piano section. The Nord Piano 3 allows you to layer or split with a sample player section they call Sample Synth. There's a huge library available for that as well. There's 256 megabytes of memory. And again, using their lossless data compression scheme, you can pack a lot of sound in. The user can actually put their own samples into the Nord Piano 3. You have an editor that runs on PC or Mac that allows you to drag waveforms and create key maps onto the uh, editor and then dump them into the instrument, which they'll stay there when you power down and load up again. So it's loading it into a uh, non-volatile memory, which is great. Um, the sample player section has a three-part envelope, attack, decay, and release. And then you also have the ability to route your velocity to the filter or to the amplifier to actually, again, tailor the samples more from your touch. You also have the ability then to assign a volume pedal or a sustain pedal or both, and of course, change the octave. Um, so right now, I'm going to add some strings, and this is a large string section, one of the many that Nord provides in their sample library. I'm going to use a CC pedal to bring up and down the strings, and I'm also going to use velocity to change the volume of the strings. So it's really nice. I can layer all different kinds of sounds in their library. I'll go to something else right now, maybe pick a, a pizzicato string section, and maybe I want to split it with the piano. So I can just touch here, I can adjust my split point, 
touch of a button in the display, it tells me the split point. And then I see these little colorful LEDs that are showing me either an F or a C split. And that'll tell me on a dark lit stage where my split occurs, which is really great. Right now I have pit strings and the piano will take over from F up. I'm going to add a little bit less reverb. I'll go to a stage sound and then I'm actually going to change the octave of the uh, pits down an octave. I'll bring them back up. Now I'm going to get into the fun part of the instrument and show you the things you can do outside of the classical domain. I'm going to grab a Rhodes patch, just switch through here and pick a, this is a nice one, a sparkle top. I'm going to add a little bit of chorusing to it and I'm going to add a touch of uh, panning, which you would have found on the stage, on the uh, suitcase model of the Rhodes. I'll set a slow panning speed. And I'm also going to add um, a little bit of EQ right now to the piano. I'll brighten up the top end a little bit. And now we have a nice, beautiful Rhodes patch here. I want to split that with a bass. So I'll pick a bass patch, and I'll split that with a, uh, a finger-played jazz bass. I want to change the envelope a little bit, turn down the reverb a little bit, and now I have a nice split combination. You'll notice the sustain pedal's grabbing the bass. I don't want that, so I'll just turn that off. This is great for the jazz musicians. There's a ton of really great sounds in the instrument. They now feature on the pianos also this beautiful second generation of sympathetic string resonance. This is what the, occurs on a grand piano when you hold notes down very, very gently. You don't strike them loud enough to make a sound. And then you actually strike other notes that relate to the notes you're holding down harmonically, as I'll demonstrate. You'll notice if I play notes that don't relate to this G octave I'm holding down, that you won't hear that sympathetic resonance. So this is the Nord Piano 3, featuring phenomenal acoustic piano recordings, samples, great electromechanical sounds, electric pianos, uh, clavinets, harpsichords, this ability for the user to put their own samples in or play from an enormous sample library. Again, that's free to the user that owns Nord products. Uh, great effects, chorusing, flanging, phasing, tremolo, pan. They even have a ring modulator and this really cool new vibe effect that's kind of like a chorusing and a tremolo at the same time. You have delay, you've got EQ with sweepable mid-band, modeling of amplifiers, uh, reverb. It's a beautiful instrument. The display is really uh, giving a lot of information, feedback for live performance. Then I would say you definitely, as a keyboard player, check out the Nord Piano 3. If you need more information or more specific details, contact your sales engineer at Sweetwater Sound. Thanks again. I'm Chris Martirano, and it's my pleasure showing you the Nord Piano 3.